Hello everyone, and today, we're back for another Lumion Legacy PvP video, and today, we're gonna be showcasing Dakuda, but we're gonna be showcasing Melee Dakuda. So I'm running Torrental Slash as my main stab move, Thunder Slam, you could run Thunder Crash, but Thunder Slam actually gets affected by Brute Force, while Thunder Crash doesn't, and I have Slap Down to hit Plant Types and Bulk Up as my setup move. But you could also run Gamma Pulse if you really want to, as like a mix set. But I'm running bulk up so I could set up sweep. I have brute force, which increases my damage to all of these moves, but also removes the secondary typing, so I can't flinch with rental slash, unfortunately. But slapdown still works, thankfully, so that's good. The TPs I have on this is 200 in the melee attack, 200 in the speed, 8 in the health, 52 in the energy puts us at 265, and the 40 in the range defense makes its range defense one higher than its melee, so protagon gets a melee attack boost. The team I have around the Kuda is Dokamore. I got Zeflin, which I'll place an air essence on, don't worry. Kraptana. I got Shyanta, Charonix, and Chartiki. With that out of the way, let's see how melee the Kuda does in battle. All right, we're into battle number one with melee the Kuda. And this team doesn't look great at all. It could do work. It could do a little bit. Like the Valkyrie could do work against. Borok it could do okay against. But everything else, not so much. Although I guess the Mentation won't know right away that this is melee. But we'll see. Uh, Helvantic. Helvantic is very bad against my team. <laughs> yeah, well, well, you know, it's bad for me. For him, it's amazing. Also, there is a Imperior, which I do got to be careful for. Uh, he doesn't have- Oh, uh, no, that thing has bars. This thing has bars. That's not great. I gotta bring you so I don't get driving force spam. I think I'll lead off with... Yeah, this will be what I do. I think I'm gonna leave Chianta at the back because there's a lot of barb setters. So it's clutch plushy might not be the most useful thing in the world. I'll lead off with Dokamore on the... Imperior. Okay. I'm just gonna hit you. I'm just gonna hit it, because I need damage. So yeah, I'm just gonna hit the Imperior. <laughs> yeah, because I don't want to get resentful. No, he no, knows. He swapped into... Fentation. Okay. That's not terrible. Although that did, like, no damage, unfortunately. That did, like, no damage, which is kind of sad. I'll set up an Icicle Traps. Okay, he just went for a geyser, which sponge! Yay! I got sponge health! Awesome. So, now he knows he can't... Sponge won't work. Could I go for a... Baffle? Yeah, he stays in. Goes for a burn up. He has burn up on Ventation. That's cool. I never actually used burn up Ventation yet. But that's pretty cool to see, I guess. But, yeah. I'm gonna go into melee Dakuda, and that's so he might think that I am Soul Burst. So what he's going to do is go into Imperior, I assume. So I'm gonna go for the Slapdown. I'm going right into Dakuda to threaten out the Ventation, and I'm clicking Slapdown. He's gonna go Imperior, I think. I'm clicking Slapdown, even though it doesn't do the most damage. It's the best in case he doesn't go Imperior, and if he stays in, Slapdown would be the best move anyway. He went Imperior. Oh, he went Wobbless! Yes! So no item for you! No item for you! So no health amulet. That's awesome. And now he knows... Now he probably knows what my set is. And he's gonna click Deep Freeze, so I'm going to go into... I'm going to Kraptana, actually. I think I'm gonna go Kraptana here just to make a different swap in. Now he knows I have the Kraptana. He went for a Luster, actually. Didn't think he was gonna go for that move, actually. But now he's gonna go Ventation, actually. He's gonna go Ventation. So no, I am gonna go... Oh no, he stayed in, I think. I think he stayed in. I think he stayed in. Nope, he went Ventation. I'm gonna go for a Frost Beam. To predict the Charonics. Predict the Charonics. Not Charonics, Imperior. Really? You went Wobblisk? 
You went Wobblisk on a Tyronix? Really? I didn't think you were going to go in on this. Alright then, I'm just going to go for Nova Blast. It's that Imperior I'm scared about. Oh, he's me Oh god, he's melee. Okay. Well, he's not gonna stay in. Crossbeam. Go into your Imperior! I know you want to! I know you want to go Imperior! I know you do! <laughs> Dang, I know you want to go Imperior! Fine, I'll go into my Dakota then. <laughs> I know you want to go Imperior! Just do it! <laughs> oh my gosh. I tried, to, I tried to be smart. Didn't work. Thankfully, Nakuda has a good melee defense stat. Gonna go for Thunder Slam. Oh, it doesn't quite KO you. Are you kidding? Just doing it for the. I'm worried about. Okay, no. Okay, he just let Wobbleus go down. That's fine. Well, he knows what a melee Nakuda now, unfortunately. If he goes Imperior, I'm just gonna sack it. But I think he's just gonna go Ventation, because now he knows what set I am. Oh no, he's Boots Helvantic. Okay, he's Boots Helvantic. So we'll go Dokamore then. We'll go Dokamore so we're not completely screwed. <laughs> Even though we kind of are. Even though we are kind of screwed. Ow. Tons of damage. Gonna go for a wait. There's no reason to not wait here. Get my energy back. He's gonna swap out back into Ventation. I could go into my... I'm not sure to go in on. I'm mainly scared about that Imperior. I'm shocked that Imperior isn't swapping in more. You know what I mean? Like, I'm kind of shocked that his Imperior is not swapping in more. Like, his Imperior hasn't been used as a sack yet. Either that or he's saving it. I don't know. I'll go to you for the Battered Ram. I should live one. I barely live one. Gonna go for a Nova Blast. I don't care about Imperior now. I could care less about Imperior coming in. Okay, so he cares less about Ventation being alive. Okay, gonna know. I'm gonna get destroyed, but that's okay. Because guess who comes in? Guess who comes on in? My Dakuda! Dakuda's coming in. Gonna go for a Thunder Slam. Gonna go for a Thunder Slam. Get on out of here, Ventation. You are dead. That crit completely didn't matter at all. Unfortunately, I think your thing outspeeds me. I think your Imperior outspeeds me. Which isn't great. I hope I can get one hit off. I need to get one hit. I need to get one hit on this. I need one hit. I need one hit. I don't think I'm going to get it, though. I think you're a Shade Shell. Please be Oak Shade. No, okay, I died anyway. Dang it, I died. I died anyway. We'll go Dokamore then. We'll go Dokamore. We'll place Icicle Traps. He still has three Lumians left? What are the rest of his Lumians? What are the rest of his Lumians? Oh boy. What are the rest of his Lumians? I hope I didn't just make a big mistake. Oh my gosh, he's setting up Peace of Mind on a Imperior. He's setting up Peace of Mind on an Imperior. Oh my gosh, I'm screwed, aren't I? I need to at least hit this thing. If I don't hit this thing, I think I'm going to die. I gotta hit this. Oh no. That did no damage! We're screwed, aren't we? I need one more hit. I need one more. I need one more. Okay, just went for another piece. Okay. Just went for another piece. I think we're gonna be okay. Faithful. No poison, but that's not the end of the world. I kinda need this for... I'm gonna save Dokamore. I'm gonna save Dokamore. Do I save Dokamore? I don't know. I'll save Dokamore. That's gonna be the play. Probably a horrible idea, but I'm saving Dokomore. We're gonna save the Dokomore. We're gonna sack the Chartiki. Alright. I made my decision. I made my decision. We're gonna go into Kraptana. Get a Vengeance kill on something. Get a Vengeance Wave Wrecker kill. 
Get out of here, Imperior. It's dead. It's not vengeance. I would have been fine the whole time. And there's the Borok, which I died to. Okay, we are screwed. We are screwed, ladies and gentlemen. I think we've lost battle number one. I didn't expect them to have Borok in the back. We lost battle number one. Unless Kraptana just owns up. I gotta crit the second attack if I wanna win. So get out of here, Borok. Borok's dead, at least, but... Yeah... It's not gonna end well. We lost to the Helvantic. Helvantic just wins. Unless I somehow live and attack, but I don't think I do. I don't think I live. Unless his move is Thunder... I don't know. Let's see. I knew it wasn't gonna be enough to KO. And I'm dead, aren't I? Live? No, I knew I wasn't gonna live. Dang it! Melee Nakuda stunk! We lost battle number one. Let's head into battle number two. Alright, battle number two with Melee Nakuda, and let's see what you have. You have... Okay. There are a couple Lumians I can use this against. The biggest threat is Dokamore, So, Slapdown's always coming first. So, that's a fun fact. Slapdown will always come first. I'm gonna bring you... Do I have anything else for the... I'll bring you for Dokamori, I guess. To be a threat. Uh, Tartiki, Kraptana. I don't know. Out of these two, which one do I bring? I think I'll bring Kraptana. Oh, if he plays his Icicle Traps, I could be screwed. I don't think he's gonna lead... Will he lead Dokamori? Will he lead Dokamori on my Dokamori? I don't know. I'm not sure, honestly. He's gonna... I, no, I think he's gonna try to anti lead Let's lead off with... I'll lead off with... Oh, crap. I'll lead off with... I'll lead off with Dokamori. Probably a bad idea, but let's do it. If I do it on the Lachette, that might not be terrible. Oh, no. We let Dokamori be the Dokamori. And that's kind of not what I wanted. We both get to place Icicle Traps. That is worst on me, because I actually didn't bring Tartiki, so I ain't great. I'll go for Baffle, though. Okay, just Earthquake, that's fine. Just Earthquake. I'll just Baffle out. And I'll click Mudslide on Zeppelin. I'll click Mudslide on Zeppelin, just to get rid of it on turn one. And I don't want to deal with these for the rest of the battle, personally. So, we'll just Mudslide. We'll see what he does. So, that's like, get on out of here. No more icicle traps. No more. He's gonna click baffle. Nope, just painful. It's fine. I'll go for a resonate to do as much damage as I can. Who will he swap into, though? The swap into Infernix, who will take a ton of damage. It will take a ton of damage. So I don't know if this thing is Power Napper or not. Yeah, that did a lot of damage. It's actually a rage for Plushy Inferno. Okay. So, if it's nimble, it outspeeds me. That's good to know. I'll just click Resonate again. Okay, I outspeed it. So, it was smart. So, okay. Infernix is dead. That's good. Infernix being dead is a good thing. Although, it's only going to be regular traps. There's Proda. I ha I did not bring Tartiki. <laughs> yeah, not bringing Tartiki. I think it's a very bad idea, Josh. I think not bringing Tartiki is a very bad idea. Oh yeah, very bad idea. Again, I could bring Dokamore. I could bring Dokamore. But I think I'm going to go under... Ah, uh, it's going to go for the Metal-type move. I know it will. I think I'm just going to sack. I'm going to go for the sack. No, I could've went Dokamori. Dang it, I could've went Doke. I got critted, too. Wouldn't have mattered, but I got critted. Gonna go into my Kraptana. And just gonna go for the Rogue Assault. To do as much damage as I can. Get on out of here, Protagon! Get on out of here! <laughs> yeah! That was a complete overkill there, Kraptana! So, that's two Lumians dead on his side, but he still has that Dokamori alive. 
And a Gargolem still alive. Although Gargolem does take a little bit of chip. Oh, I can't use Melee Dakuda on that. I think I'll sack Dokamore and then go Melee Dakuda. That might be what I do. Yeah, that'll probably be what I do. I'll sack Dokamore. Because the thing is with Gargolem... With the thing is with Gargolem, I think I can... Okay, it's not Secret Ability. Let's use that to our advantage then. Bakuda, you are in! And I'll go for the Torrental Slash. Stayed in. Landslide, I live. I live easy. Torrental Slash. Melee Dakuda gets a KO! Well, that's good. So he has a... He has... Okay, so Mismax is his last one. So we know what his last one is. Is Torrental Slash the best play? Or is... I don't know what the best play is when it is my mass. Like, Tyronix wins the game. And if not, Kreptana wins the game. So we're fine. I think we beat the my mass. But, I don't know. I think I think it's going to go for Fade Away. I'm going to click Slap Down. It's going to go for Fade Away. No, it stayed in. Oh, it didn't just... Okay. Oh, me. Right off the bat. Okay. <laughs> okay, my mass. I see how it is. I see how it is. We'll go for the Rogue Assault and just go for the complete overkill. Get on out of here. <laughs> yeah, Bootscrap Tana's pretty okay. <laughs> yeah, Melee Dakuda Showcase, more like Bootscrap Tana Showcase. And this last thing is the Dokomore. We win this no matter what. The Dokomore is too low. I don't have to sack Dakuda. I don't have to sack Crap Tana. I have a Tyronix in the very back. So I'll just go into you. You go for the Earthquake. It's going to do a little bit. It does a little bit, but not that much. Go for the Frost Beam, and that will be a GG's. Melee Dakuda was able to defeat the Gargolem, so it was able to do a little bit of work. We won battle number two. Let's head into battle number three with Melee Dakuda. All right, battle number three with Melee Dakuda. And, okay, this battle's really bad. <laughs> this battle's very bad. Oh, boy. This battle. <laughs> Sorelli, Metronette, Moray, Hunter outspeeds. This thing doesn't, but could be Joel. This thing outspeeds. So, yeah, this battle doesn't look so great. Especially Gargolem attack. Gonna bring you, and I'll bring... I'll bring you, and I'll bring you to live a Clutch Plushie hit. Although I kind of want to bring this thing for that. So I ain't just cannon fodder, so yeah, I'll do that. I'll bring... I'll actually lead off with Melee Dakuda. Let's see if I get a good matchup. I don't think it's going to be Gargolem Attack Form lead. It's going to be Marafe lead. Okay, that actually isn't terrible at all. That's gonna melee attack. But I live a hit. I get to do a ton of damage to you. So I'm gonna go for a Torrental Slash and do some massive damage. He may think I'm ranged. So, I Shock Factor with the... Ah! Ah! So close! So close! We'll go for Slap Down. Jeez, that almost one-shotted a Marate. Jeez, that hits hard. Yeah, Melee Dakuda can hit pretty hard. I know Marafe has no melee defenses, but that hit pretty hard. I could still use this to hit Tower Claw, so that's fine. There's the Phage Knot. Phage Knot's not great. Gonna bring the... Chartiki. Even though you're gonna get free momentum. <laughs> you're gonna get free momentum. Okay, just went for Power Draw, that's fine. Okay, your secret ability. There's no way you're not secret ability. Your secret ability fades you not all the way. Gonna go for a Mucklat to try to throw poison on something. I don't think he's gonna stay in. Yeah, he swaps out into Tarkov. Oh, I should have clicked Fire Breath. I should have clicked Fire Breath. I screwed up. I screwed up. Fun fact, I screwed up. Don't go for the Thunder Chomp. Nice. Mega. I live. Awesome. 
Wave Wrecker on the face not coming in. Nope, stays in, so goodbye, Hunter. Hunter's dead, so that's good. Got rid of the Hunter. Phage not, I probably would outspeed. So, if I can get a bulk up off, I might be able to do a lot of damage to her. I don't think I can one-shot it. I think I would have to get the plus two with Torrental Slash the one-shot. But I can still do a lot of damage with a Torrental Slash. I mean, get it low, and then I can go into something else with Revenge Killer. Yeah, he's going back into Phage not. I'll go into... I'll still go, I'll still go Chartiki, and then I'll go for the heal this turn. I'll go for the heal this turn. Thank gosh I have a couple. Oh, he went for Zip that time, and it critted me. So I'm screwed! So yeah, I gave himself free momentum. I think he has Boots Phage Knot. By the way he's playing this, I think he's a Boots Phage Knot. So, I don't think my Takuda would outspeed it at all. I think it's a Boots version. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh. Why? Oh, you're gonna play that game on me? Are you going to play that game on me? Where you hypnotize the entire team? Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is, Metronet. I see how it is. Oh boy! Oh dear! Oh dear! Oh dear and me! We are screwed, aren't we? We're screwed. You're soul burst. You're soul burst, Metronet, aren't you? You're soul burst, hypnotized, Metronet, aren't you? Aren't you? Can I get a crit or a rage attack drop, maybe? Okay, that did no damage. Double blast again. <laughs> oh no, this is awful. I should have just light sped Ray and done damage. Now I'm gonna get swept! I'm gonna get swept off the floor, I think! Hypnotize! What do I do now? I. What do I do now? Don't go for spirit shackles. You don't have to. Live. I lived one. Okay. I lived one. I lived one. Awesome. Crabtana. Crabtana. I need you more than ever. Oh, I credit it. Yes. Thank you, Tyronix. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Like, I have Krabton in the back, but still. Thank you! <laughs> Fage not. Yeah, Fage not comes back in, gets a free attack on something. Maybe I can awake the... Maybe I can awake the Chartiki. Like, I have a... If I can get the... The Kuda in, I might be able to do a lot of damage. Okay, went for Flash and Flea. Perfect. Oh, and I woke! I woke up! Because of Mysterious Dust! W! Finally, the mysterious dust pops off right when I need it. Awesome. Now, don't crit me this time. Don't crit me this time, Phage Knot. It's going to crit me. Let's be honest here. It's going to stay in and crit me. Okay, swap. I get, I get a heal off. I get a heal off on a Gargolem attack form. This thing's still alive. Oh, dear. This thing's still alive. At least I know what his last two is. But I don't think I'm going to be using Melee Nakuda in this one. Unless I chip the Gargolo. I'm going to have to chip it a little bit. I'm going to have to chip it. I don't have barbs up, which sucks. And I'm going to get jet streamed on. Ow! Ow! That hits hard, man. That hits hard. You hit hard. You don't have to hit that hard. <laughs> I guess it has to, but still. You don't have to hit that hard. Yeah, it's Power Cups. It's using a bunch of energy. Are you a Secret Ability Alpha? It's not Secret Ability Alpha. Okay, Takuda. You can lift one, right? Right? You can lift one, right? I, I hope you can. I want to kind of use you. That's why I brought you in. Oh, I outsped you. And you're not clutch plushy. Okay, you're not clutch plushy. Awesome! 
Melee Nakuda gets another KO. That's his second of the battle. Let's go. Now, who's your last one? Is the faint not? I'm, I'm just going to go for a torrental slash. Just do some damage. And I was right. This was your boot slip. So, I was right. The faint not was your boot slip. Hey, there's me being smart. I'll go into Craftana to get a Vengeance Sit, because this is your last one. Yeah, it's your last one left, so I'm just going to get a Wave Wrecker off as a Vengeance Sit. Let's see how much this does. Oh my gosh! Craftana, you hit hard! You hit hard! But yeah, we win the battle anyway. But yeah, Melee Dakuda actually did pretty good in this video. I see a lot of people run boots Melee Dakuda, but the thing is it has bulk up. So I think it's just better if you're running a boot set. I think it's better to run four moves with boots. Kind of run like a mix set with Slapdown and Gamble Pulse because dark light coverage is amazing. So yeah. That was awesome, though. Bailey Dakuda was able to do some work. I didn't get to click bulk up at any point in the battles, but it still did a lot of damage. It almost one-shot him a Wraith, which is kind of fun. And I was able to one-shot the Gargola of the attack form twice. So, Dakuda, very good. Bailey Dakuda, pretty good. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see y'all all later. Bye-bye!